Hey everyone, this is James with WS News. I want to bring you an important update here from the Gateway Pundit. The headline is, Never Trump Lincoln Project desperately calls on Garland to weaponize DOJ to open investigation against Trump over RFK Jr. cabinet offer. So the Lincoln Project, a group of rhinos suffering with severe Trump derangement syndrome or TDS has taken its vendetta to new heights. For context, Never Trump Lincoln Project co-founder Steve Schmidt resigned from the board amid a huge scandal that has plagued the anti-Trump pack, including grooming underage teen boys. The Never Trumpers at the Lincoln Project were scrambling to put out fires after one of their married founders was caught sending sexually explicit messages to young men. 21 men accused Lincoln Project co-founder John Weaver of online harassment. Now, the Never Trump PAC sent a letter to Attorney General Merrick Garland on Friday. The group has called for an immediate investigation into Trump, alleging a violation of federal laws related to the 2024 presidential election. The Lincoln Project's letter, signed by their general counsel, Mario Nicolais, demands that Garland's Department of Justice, or DOJ, investigate whether Trump violated 18 U.S.C. 599 and 18 U.S.C. 600 by purportedly offering a cabinet position to Robert F. Kennedy Jr., allegedly in exchange for his endorsement. According to the Lincoln Project, this alleged offer is a clear-cut case of Trump's attempt to secure political support through promises of employment, a move they claim is not only unethical, but illegal under federal law. The group further alleges that Trump's actions constitute yet another instance of his ongoing efforts to manipulate the outcome of presidential elections, pointing to his prior legal troubles as evidence of a pattern of behavior. So I'm just kind of laughing here as I read through their complaint. Um, it says, for example, RFK Jr.'s own family member recently wrote in the Washington Post that my cousin, Robert F. Kennedy Jr., endorsed Trump reportedly in an exchange for a cabinet-level position overseeing efforts in the health arena. So, yeah, I think this is kind of funny here. They're trying to spin it as this was an exchange when reality, I think, you know, RFK Jr. and his campaign just realized, hey, we're going to take votes away from Trump. We're going to hurt Trump. You know, we've got no shot at winning this thing. So why hurt Trump? Why give Kamala and, you know, Waltz that boost? Let's just remove ourselves from the ballot in certain key swing states, you know, so we don't hurt Trump there, but maybe keep our name on the ballot in other states where we can hurt Kamala. So, yeah, they're trying to spin this as, you know, some type of an exchange for a position for him to drop out and get that endorsement. But, um, yeah, I want to know what do you think, everybody out there watching this video, let me know in the comments what do you think here about uh these never Trumpers, this uh, Lincoln project, you know, calling on the DOJ to open an investigation against Trump over this supposed breaking of the law. So let me know what you think in the comments. I appreciate you for taking the time to watch this and I will talk to you soon.